Okay, I'm recording this set of videos in order to go along with my sky shawl pattern, um, but of course I'm just demonstrating common techniques, so you can use them for whatever. In this one, I'm demonstrating the provisional cast on. In order to do the provisional cast on, you need your needles. I use circulars all the time, but I'm actually going to be knitting back and forth, so of course street needles work. Um, you need a, a length of scrap yarn, preferably cotton, so that it doesn't get balled up in your working yarn, and then you need your working yarn. So. Um, let's get started. To get started on the provisional cast on, you simply do a regular slip knot and then you slip it onto your right hand needle um, with the tail that goes to the yarn on top and the short tail on the bottom. Um, there are some people who in a provisional cast on will not use this as a final stitch. They're, they'll take it off at the end. I use my knot because I quite frankly haven't ever been able to see it so I don't worry about it. Um, you don't probably want it super tight, about like that is fine. Okay, so then you simply make a little space here between the tail going to your ball and the, and the scrap tail. You put your scrap yarn underneath it, and then you take your yarn tail that's going to the ball over that scrap yarn, and then over your needle. Again, over the scrap yarn, around it, and over your needle. As you can see, I'm leaving some space here. Um, sometimes you'll see directions, even in my patterns, to use a larger needle for your provisional cast on. That's in order to make that space so that your stitches turn out big enough. I typically, nowadays, do not use a larger needle because I have more problem with two big stitches than two small. Uh, but it's really up to you and your preference. Again, take your, your working yarn, put it over your scrap yarn, around it, and then over your needle to create the stitch. And then sometimes you may have to kind of get them untangled a little bit because the two ends will get a little funny. Um, and then as you can see here, I have four stitches on my needle but only three on my yarn. So you're gonna wanna go around again to create four and four. And for my particular pattern, I'm only gonna cast on four. So I will leave it there.